Hi folks, Nathaniel here at Chicago Music Exchange, joined by Percy, how's it going? Good man, how are you? I'm doing very well. Good, so, man. we've got some special Epiphone guitars here. Now, it's the 150th anniversary of Epiphone Instruments, one of the longest and richest guitar histories ever, which is called 150 years. 150 years is a long time. I man. didn't know that. So what <laughs> they've done, they've taken four of their most well-known models and they've made some limited editions and I think we're going to have some fun with them, right? Let's do it. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Let's do it. So what year were they founded? 150 minus, go. 1873 and I didn't look. Oh, you didn't? <laughs> yeah, okay. You didn't look, but there's someone over there telling them, right? Someone in the corner. Well, correct, 1873, so that's a very long time. Now, the guy's name, I can't, I'm not gonna shame myself by trying to pronounce his name, but his nickname yeah. was Epi. Yeah. And uh, the Greek word for, is it Greek? Yeah. Yeah, for sound is phone. Epi phone. That is pretty clever. That's I pretty clever. Be Genius. I be so this is the Zephyr uh, Deluxe Regent, aged antique natural. Hmm. Uh, so this is made from, well it was made uh, from 1948 to 1957. Mm -hmm. uh, now as, as you can tell it's perfect for kind of jazz, blues and a little bit of rockabilly. Uh, so I mean we were doing some uh, some interesting outside sounds I should say. We were uh, absolutely doing yeah. some stuff. <laughs> I mean even, even the rockabilly. Definitely. Yeah. I mean, it, it sounds great for that. It's very big and uh, boomy. I mean, if you do that, oh. it's like a floor tom. Dun, dun. Drum feature. Exactly. It's also a drum. So, so it's a drum <laughs> that can do jazz. Um, five piece uh, maple mahogany neck as well. Um, I mean, that's beautiful. a great looking oh, neck. Yeah, look at that. that. I didn't even notice that, man. That's beautiful. That is, that's some tasty work there, right? Absolutely. That's nice. Good. Good. So I have the Sheridan, which yeah. is in cherry, which is beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I do believe that this is one of their most recognized, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, it's a uh, rival to the 335, of yeah. course. No, it's, it's a classic guitar though, right? Absolutely. That's, I mean, yeah. I feel like this covers everything that you probably yeah. want. An versatile guitar, you know what I mean? Something yeah. you can do everything with. I love the whammy. Yep. My whammy got my stuff. There so. we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, gorgeous so, colour, I do yeah, love the colour in that. And, I must uh, say, I like down by the tailpiece, that little uh, kind yes, of F1 thing. Yes, I feel like this cool, was though. a nice touch to it, you yeah. know what I mean? So, get a load of that. Great looking. And I love the gold, I mean the gold is yeah. a really nice touch to it, so. You know, I want to hear you pronounce how you say this. 
No. Will Shire. <laughs> Will Shire. Will Shire. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm only one of you. So this is this is the Wilshire uh, Pacific Blue. It's a great looking colour. I mean, my eyes are a bit dodgy. I thought it was grey at first. Absolutely. But now they're like lovely Pacific Absolutely. Blue. Have you ever been in the Pacific? I've never been in the it Pacific. It looks exactly like that. And that I can believe. Check I it out. Take your <laughs> So, uh, it's uh, an F1 original solid body released in 1959. Gotcha. Uh, popular Batwing style headstock. I mean, I do love the headstock. Yeah, I mean, it's wavy. Crestwood Custom California Coral is this one, and it's beautiful. First appeared in 1958, mm -hmm. and uh, then it got renamed. Of course, they wanted to get tricky with all those C's yeah, <laughs> in 59. Yeah. So it's really nice, asymmetrical, solid mahogany double cutaway. Check that out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Double cutaway again, like you said. I loved it. I thought it was a really nice guitar. I mean, I love the inlays. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I think that's pretty A few little jazzy. differences. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The inlays, cool. obviously, the whammy. But yeah, it's beautiful. It's a nice guitar. Very easy to play, I've got to say. Absolutely. If you had to choose one out of four. Oh, the tough question. Putting you on the spot. You are putting me on the spot. And I think I am going to have to go with the shared in this. Yeah. It's the one. I, I think mean, it's the one that makes it. If, so, if, I don't have like an arch type guitar. I don't either. Yeah. So I'd be kind of leaning towards Inclined. this but yeah so great guitars probably great not guitars. gonna last too long 150th anniversary uh from greece i still can't believe that that's cool Do you like Greek food? Absolutely, come yeah, on, man. man. Just meat. Some of the best. That's all I want. I've got a Absolutely. fly in my head. Did you see that? <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> He's still around. Look, look at him. Can we Drew, can make his debut? You? Can zoom you zoom in, in on him? Can you zoom in on him? Zoom in on him, man. Where are you going? There he is. There he is. Look at that. It's part of the CME crew now. Do you reckon I can get him? Do flies have ears? <laughs> give him a rumble. <laughs> you can't hear me. Sensei. Does come he? on, man. Show off your skills. Hey, fly, A13. <laughs> e minor 9. Oh, he likes that one. Yeah, he moves a little bit on that. The Hendrix chord. <laughs> oh, he shuffled a little bit. How little boogie woogie. Yeah. He's not going anywhere, he likes it. He started to shuffle, though. <laughs> his back legs are gone. His mate is here somewhere as well, see him. Oh, and he's off. <laughs> 